Actually, what I expected to learn was just the theory. I didn't know that it was going to be so practical, so about personalizing a learning experience, so about really asking you the questions to get you to think about the deeper learning objectives. So the ePortfolio really gave us an opportunity to sit down and reflect on what we learned in class outside of the classroom settings. Now this may sound really easy, but when you actually sit down and personalize the learning, it gets a little tough. So for example, in the Arbus 300, you learn about time management. So you know the theory and how, about how ma time management should be done, but if you apply that to yourself and say, what, time, what does time management mean to me? It takes it to a whole different level. What I already knew, what most people already know going to the course, is the theory and how it should be done. So what entrepreneurship is, what innovation is, what creativity is. But what we didn't know, or what most of us don't know at that point, is how this applies to you. So for every learning, you have to always link it back to yourself and find the meaning that you think it's best applied to your career. As busy students, we don't have the time to connect each learning. So what we learn in marketing, what we learn in finance, and what we learn as what we learn in entrepreneurship, everything. So the ePortfolio really gave us an opportunity to sit down and see how I can express the learning all as a comprehensive thing. Um, so in the beginning, I really hated the ePortfolio, actually, um, because there is so much freedom in it, as I mentioned before. And when you can have so many things to put on it. You could write, you could put me um, videos, you could put music, you could you know, put random pictures of your cats. I didn't know what to put on it at first. So it trained me to think about every time what I, um, everything I, that I put on my assignments outside of the artist classes, I would think about, is this graph adding value to the assignment? Is this picture adding value to the assignment? So in that case, the ePortfolio really took me to the next level.